Welcome everyone to my new channel. Uh, from what I've learned from recording this video four different times, each of them failing in one perspective, is that I should speak more clearly, or I, I don't know. I I'm not that good at English. But anyway, before I start this let's play, is that I want to address some issues first. Uh, at the moment, my setup isn't completely the best, but uh, it works. Hopefully, as you see by the quality, it's not too bad. But uh, in the audio, there's this odd issue with this constant buzzing noise. I'm not sure if hopefully I can edit it out, but um, or make volume a little bit less so I can make it, you know, sound be less, you know. Whatever. Anyway, for this channel, I, I'm gonna be um, doing Nintendo Let's Plays, mainly on the Wii. Uh, I, might, I may do some GameCube games, who knows. Um, and maybe, I, if I have any way to record it on the computer, I'll probably do some PC games. Anyway, uh, as you know by my uh, account name, it's BlueDockerZ. But, um, you may call me Blue in the comments or anything, if anyone's watching this. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Oops. So, here we go. Um, yeah, this, 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 there's many reasons why I chose this game, but I'll get into that later. CC, um... Yeah, let's create a new file here. Naruto. And let's begin. See why that person is. Now, let me tell you a new story that also begins with Stardust. Shimmering Stardust falls on the Mushroom Kingdom once a century. That time will come again. Dear Mario. Would you like to share some cake while we watch the shooting stars? Meet me at the castle, Peach. Anyway, I'm I'm gonna try not to do any any like um, voice acting because um so I just begun so it's everywhere it's all right. because right now it's not a good time for me it's more for your sake rather than mine well it also is for my sake because I'm going through puberty and you know the effects of puberty anyway star bits rain down from the sky yeah they explain how to get them by you know doing that and this Whoa. Where am I? Mom? Wait, what? The strange little fellow seemed confused. Wait, where am I? What the heck? Hmm, that was some party last night. You seem to take a shine to Mario. Oh, look. Hey, let's just get go inside this random guy's hat. Mario's cap filled with warmth as he felt new power surging through him. Okay. Basically, that little guy gives you the power to spin, which, if you jump and then spin, you can go a little bit higher than usual, and uh, if you spin items like these, you can break them. Find others of his kind. Let's see. And whoa. Okay. I'll stop with the surprise fakes. Sorry, I got distracted there. It was like an ant crawling around my equipment. Too late, Mario. The power of the stars is already mine. And look what else I got. Wow. 
Yeah, blah blah blah, he goes on and on about how he wants to take over the galaxy and like, you know, I think he has dementia or something. And he leaves, leaving the Mushroom Kingdom. And, who are you? Stay calm, say yeah, this is you who's running the screen. Anyway, let's head to over here. Mario, where did that monster come from? He took the princess and sent it to the universe. Must hurry and save her. Okay, whatever you say. Whatever you say. Oh, my son Luma. Yeah, anyway, just go on about how he fell off. And first suicide of the game. Inside that launch star thing, and then you end up um, getting launched into space. Nothing unusual. <laughs> People run. So. Yeah, okay, here we go. Yeah. Yes. stars. I got something. Anyway, I can't speak English today, so I'm not gonna bother reading the text. Anyway, he says you have to bring back your power, the power stars to them. And what's this? Okay, so this is Yoshi's house. I never knew that he even had enough money to get a house. Um, oh, the first enemy. Uh, this is I call them space goombas, but they're probably not called that. Uh, you can jump on them to get a coin, or you can spin them up to get a star bit. Go into this pipe. You go into this little cage where you can find a little a life. Anyway, that section of the music is like. I, I just love that section of the music, and there's other great music in this game as well. It's one of the reason why, reasons why I chose this one. Um, second enemy. Uh, ow. 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 Oh my goodness. No! 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 Wow! I almost died to two Goombas. Wow. Anyway, those are like regular Goombas. You can jump on them to get a coin as well, or you can spin them and then touch them to, um, to get three star bits. And actually, that green pipe you saw on the other side brings you over here. Uh, you spin this, and then that guy's like, Oh, you saved me! Blah, blah, blah! And you're actually supposed to jump down here. But if you think you're awesome enough, you can te technically just backflip or something over here. Yeah, okay. Suicide number two. No, no! Anyway, this is our third enemy, Octumas. They're blue little creatures that shoot rocks at you. Like over here, let me show you. But they have a certain rain, and this one happens to be like that. So you can either jump on them, or you can just spin them. They're actually easier to kill than Goombas. Um, but they have more, better means of attacking you. So... Yeah, but they're kind of more like, actually, um, they're kind of like the Goombas of the Galaxy series, except they appear as much as the regular Goombas. In this coin, you can, you can find, um, this thing, what do I call the notes? No! No! No, I'm not going to say this, 
But anyway, uh, yeah, if you collect all the notes, you get those things. The gold coins may not necessarily, um, give you that, but if some, sometimes, like this time, they do. If you spin in a circle, uh, like this pattern, you spin, you get star bits. Yay, that's all I wanted for this one. And this light thing. As you can see over there, um, it's like this weird area. Basically, throughout the galaxies, there are spaces like these where if you make it, spin in them, excuse me, um, you can get to the secret areas where basically you just kill all the enemies and then. Oh, what? No, shoot. And then basically, three lives pop out up here. And that power up over there was Rainbow Mario. It's similar to the. the it's basically the star in the regular Super Mario games. Well, not. I mean, by regular, I mean like 2D platformer games. So, yeah, they're pretty much the same exact thing. Who knows, if I'm fancy, I'll get a bit of video editing, movie maker. So, side number three. So, yeah, you go over here. You can go over here. Uh, we go to other planet. Okay. And then over here. Oh my god, can I please? Please? Yes, okay. Basically, uh, you can get up there. To get that, um, so yeah, um, yeah, uh, actually, you're supposed to go like this, um, and you're supposed to go around here to get that. If you're a noob like that, but I just feel like fa being fancy, even though the less play curse is gonna catch up to me sooner or later. However, and then here we go. Here. And this takes us to the main section of this little level. Yeah, you can find coins or star bits inside the grass. Uh, I, I don't feel like going along here, but if you go along there, you can find a life, except in this game. Well, that works too, but um, lives aren't very important in this game because. Um, like, once you exit the game, uh, and come back, lives actually reset to, uh, to four, which is technically five, because the zero is lot live, life, um, counts as life, I don't get it either, but, but, you know, you know what, you know what Mr. Chuck Conroy says, or his friend, for that matter, um, Nintendo Logic. Okay, anyway, these things are comet medals. Basically, they're star coins. And if you get enough of them, prankster comets will come to each galaxy. And, um, yeah, basically, uh, they alter the level a bit. And, you know. And suicide number four. Okay, here we go. Uh, yeah, this is, um, a life shroom. The, the lives actually are one-ups, but whatever. This is a life shroom. Gives you six health instead of three health. And yeah, and once you get go back to three health, it just drops down to, to ma your max health being three. Okay, this is a checkpoint. When you die, you come back to here. Um, instead of going over, oh my god. It's very sad how I'm like failing against such. But you know what they say. The last play curse. He will. Okay, at least there wasn't a suicide. Wait. Wait a minute. That thing's talking to me. That means it was also a suicide. 
But anyway, if you go back here, you find the, the one up. And if you and here we go. Um, this is PP Piranha. The goal this fight. Oh my. Seriously? Okay, anyway. Basically, you just hit his butt. And then his his orange, brown orange butt is exposed. And then you just hit it again while it's open. And yeah. And what, what is Nintendo teaching us? Yeah, this is the second phase. Basically, he just gets angry, he gets he gets faster and stuff, but the goal is the same, just hit his butt, and he will... What? You... Ow! Once you hit his butt enough times, and he is dead. I know, we're bullying babies, child abuse, watch. I guess it's okay when they're trying to kill you. Woo! Yeah, anyway, um... So yeah, that was PvP Piranha. Not a hard boss fight at all, if you know what to do. Which is actually kind of obvious, considering, like, the size of his gluteus maximus. But anyway, um... I'm just collecting some star bits here. They're more useful later in the game, but I just feel like collecting them now. Uh, if you go over here, um, uh, and you shoot a star bit at it, comes, uh, a coin, oh wow, I had more star bits last time I played it, but anyway, as I was saying, um, Yeah, they count the star bits and stuff. I like them apples. So you're this Mario guy, my little Lumas won't stop blabbing about it, am I right? Sorry to hear about the excitement you have with that monster down the road. I'm sorry he changed voices. I sure appreciate you bringing us the star power star, though. We need as many of these as we can get. The name's Lubble, by the way. Bye. Doesn't that name fit this fat tub of lard? Seriously. I'm the head honcho of the Luma crew. See, believe it or not, we're on a spaceship right now. It took some real level grease to convert this little planet into a ship, but we Lumas pulled it off. May not look like much, but it's home. Truth be told, the ship, she's not in such hot shape right now. He ran into that monster, too. He blasted us with meteors, and some of my crew were thrown overboard. So that monster kidnapped your princess, hey, that's cold. These face cold if you ask me. Aren't you gonna save your fellow Lumas? You know what else is cold? That monster stealing every last one of our parasites. Seriously, you're letting them suicide for me? See, that's our fuel. Our spaceship runs on energy from... We, without that, we're stranded here. Ah. Hey yo, is that young Master Luma? It is, isn't it? Wait, if the blah blah blah. Oh my God. Get me out now. You're special. I got kidnapped, and now you gotta say. And they give us let's. That's right. And yes. <laughs> that one's closer to no. Give us that again, I'll just say yes this time. And to the power of Goku! What do you think? Nice spaceship. Yeah, spaceship. That is correct. 
Anyway, um, now that we have time here, I'm just gonna review the, the what's called, um, the controls really quickly. Um, jump is A, if you didn't know that. Um, uh, spinning is obviously shaking. Um, to crouch, you press C. Uh, to do a backflip, you do Z, A, because you crouch and then jump. To do a long jump, you do, you run first and then you do a long jump thing, but, um, uh, also, if you run in one direction and then you go really quickly backwards and then jump at the same time, you do a, a side jump or whatever. Yeah, I think it's called side jump. Um, and... Also, ground pound is jump and then crouch, and then uh, if you shake and then ground pound, you do like a ho semi homing. What, the what was that? But yeah. Anyway, this is Starship Mario. This is a little hub world. Basically, to go to an another galaxy, you go over here. So, uh, hold. Stay on it for a bit. Like, I'm not sure how many seconds. It's like three seconds. But yeah, once once that happens, uh, you get taken to the world map. But I think... I think um, we'll head to the second one, second level in the next episode. So, um, in the next episode, we'll be tackling maybe a new galaxy. And, um... We'll get, we'll, I'll show you the, like, the world map, and we'll tackle a new galaxy. Well, uh, thank you for watching, and please support me. I'm not gonna beg, but, yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. Bye.